here's how to clear the WhatsApp cache on your iPhone. Now, if you're on your iPhone, but the WhatsApp app is just taking up too much space and you want it to clear out and delete all of the cache files that you don't necessarily need, I'll show you how to do it. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now let's open up the WhatsApp app here. And first we'll do something in the app and then in the settings. So tap on settings at the very bottom, right? And then on here, you can see at the very bottom is storage and data. Let's tap on that. And then at the very top, tap on manage storage. Now you'll be able to see all of the various messages on here and videos that you've sent and received. And some of these are taking up potentially a lot of space. So if you wanted to clear out any of these, you can tap on the, for instance, the conversation like Netflix here. And there are a bunch of random videos for whatever reason. I can hit select. I'm going to hit select all at the bottom and delete and delete. So essentially, you can delete out all of these random videos and files that you don't necessarily need. This will, again, help reduce the overall size of WhatsApp on your phone. Now, let's hop out of here and to find all the cache and delete it, we're going to tap on settings and then we're going to tap on general and iPhone storage. Now that we're in here, we're going to look for the WhatsApp app here. There it is. And we're just going to hit offload this app and reinstall it. By going through this process, it downloads a fresh new version of WhatsApp, but it also clears out all of the previous cache on here. So essentially, you'll be able to see that documents and data size gets reduced. We can hop out of here and open up WhatsApp again, and it should be running a lot smoother, but also just taking up less space on your iPhone. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.